My goal is to change this country from being dependent to self-reliant, and I think in that I am succeeding. Joblessness, recession, crises. It's a dangerous game to make enemies left, right, and center. Not if one is comfortable with having enemies. Are you? Oh, yes. Good morning, Gillian. How are Hello. you? Hello. Nice know, to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm in Peru, and I'm a huge fan of the of the show. And now with you, it's like, you know, you're such a virtual actress. From sex education, a super relaxed woman, super fun, to this very stiff, controlled woman. So, you know, as an actor, how do you, you know, play with all these ideas and now with Margaret Thatcher? Well, I guess, I mean, that that is precisely, I guess, what's fun about being an actor. Um, uh -huh. You know, when you get an opportunity to play such different characters um, and taking on someone uh, like Margaret Thatcher, who has a very, very um, specific um, look and sound and mannerisms and good <laughs> dressing. And, you know, she can be recognized from afar by just her profile. You know, as much of a challenge as that is to figure out how to put it together, it's also a lot of fun. The, the previous process, how long takes you, how many videos you watch, how many times you, you know, rehearse the voice and all that, all that process, how was it? Yeah, I, I mean, a lot. I mean, I I started work on it a few months uh, beforehand, so got to read a lot, um, watched endless videos and interviews <laughs> and um, uh, read biographies, listened to autobiography and a lot of um, interviews that she did. Mm -hmm. um, and then started, you know, the work with the the, um, the people who were creating the wig or the wig because yeah. there were more than one wig and the costume designers and stuff. So it was nice. I, I had a lot of time running up to it to get ready, um, which was great. We are the same age after all. Really? Just six months between us. Oh. And who is the senior? I am. Mum. And something that I really want to congratulate you is because you disappear. I mean, Gillian Anderson disappear. It's like you blend with the character and it's, 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 the work is perfect. So oh, I really enjoy that. Thank you very much. It's so kind. Thank you. And uh, when you're reading the script, what kind of protocol do you think? No, this, this, is, this is impossible. This is real. <laughs> when Thatcher is invited into the audience room, at, at what point she needs to curtsy and originally i think there may be um hands were kissed originally when the prime ministers came into the room and uh, yeah so a, a lot of things that you have to think about but i think a lot of that well especially i guess in the second episode when we go to balmoral yes and, yes. <laughs> uh, and there's so much protocol that they have to follow uh, and they and they actually don't follow because they get it completely <laughs> wrong yeah that was uh, apparently a, a good portion of that in terms of what a disaster that first uh, <laughs> trip to Balmora was. Uh -huh. uh, apparently, that's uh, uh, there's a lot of fact there. Yeah. Also, you met the Queen for real. So, how was the experience? I, I have met the Queen for real. Yeah. I mean, I haven't I haven't seen her um, since I've been working on the Crown. I mean, mm -hmm. I have you know, but I, I have met her on a, on a few very short occasions where you're brought in her presence for you know 0.5 seconds or whatever <laughs> yes well Gila, thank you so much for your time so now is the crown and margaret thatcher is back so thank you again <laughs> thank you